with the Reds suffering a minor defensive crisis, for Benho has slotted in at centre-back recently for Jurgen Klopp. The Brazilian shown at the back in the 1-0 win at Brighton last weekend alongside Virgil van Dijk. It comes with Joel Matip, Joe Gomez and Dijon Lovren all spending time on the sidelines with a variety of injuries. But for Winho, who was signed in the summer from Monaco, has now given an insight into Klopp's training. Some weeks ago, I knew this could be an option, because we had some players out injured, and we only had two centre-backs available, for Winho told Liverpool's official website. When Dijon got injured, I knew it would be logical that I'd play in that position. I had some training sessions playing in that position, which helped me adapt better and pick up certain aspects, like positioning and movements you need to be natural at to play in this position. When it came to playing in a game it was a bit easier, because I trained in the position. Close quote Liverpool right back Trent Alexander-Arnold has been ruled out for two weeks with any problem. Matt it was back on the bench against Brighton, but Reds hero John Aldridge expects Klopp to buy a new defender in the summer. For Benho once again showed his versatility for Liverpool Aldridge said after the weekend's win at the Amex. Hopefully he won't have to for much longer with the return of Joel Matip. He is likely to make his comeback at the weekend against Crystal Palace and Joe Gomez is on the mend, so I think Liverpool are over that defensive crisis they had, but Fabinho has helped out massively. This summer though, Klopp might be looking at bringing in a centre-back. Matip and Dijon Lovren pick up plenty of niggly knocks and injuries, but Gomez is the one who has been extremely unlucky. I expect Matip to return to the defence at the weekend, but Fabinho deserves to keep his place somewhere in this team. Close quote It remains to be seen where Fabinho will line up when Liverpool welcome Crystal Palace to Anfield for Saturday's Premier League clash, 3pm.